Jason Allen here from Play It Software. Today I'll show you how to broadcast to radio.co using Play It Live. If you haven't done so already, you can go to radio.co and sign up for a free trial account from their website via radio.co forward slash pricing. You can scroll down to their light option if you want to trial a cheaper option for their free trial. So once you're signed up under the live section, you can click on connection details. And this will give you the details that you need to broadcast live from Playet Live to radio.co. Now if you've got live anytime enabled, you'll see these details and you'll be able to broadcast without making any further changes. Otherwise if you can't see this, you'll need to go to schedule and scroll down to the current time and create a slot for the broadcast. So you just drag and drop and you can choose advanced and live DJ and choose the DJ who is meant to be live at that time and click create event. And this will create event for me at this slot. Going back to the dashboard, you can see the details that we need to take a copy of. So if you take a copy of the host port and pass, we'll be using these in Play It Live to get connected. So on Play It Live, you can broadcast to an internet radio server like radio.co using the internet broadcast plugin. Now you can download this by going to plugins and plugin manager, and then click on browse plugins in the plugin gallery. Once this is loaded, you can click on get for free beside internet broadcasts, and then log in with your Playet software account. It will ask you to confirm the terms and conditions. Uh, just tick this box and say get this plugin. And then it will install the plugin into your Playet Live. Then click Exit Plugin Gallery and double click on the Internet Broadcast plugin in the Plugin Manager. To broadcast the audio from Playet Live, you can select Play it live main mix, or you can select any of the other inputs into your computer, such as your microphone or some inputs into an external sound card, for example. I'll just choose the main mix for now, and then I'll select add streams to add the radio.co stream. The server type that you want to select here is Shoutcast V1, and then enter the host from radio.co in the server address. Enter the radio.co port into the server port and enter the pass into the password field. Then select the bitrate quality, in this case it's 128 kilobits per second and stereo. And then enter your station name and all these details. And select enable title streaming and this will stream the name of the currently playing track to the radio.co servers so your listeners can see the name of the track and click on OK. Now we can click on start streams and we should be ready to broadcast. Now if this says fail to connect make sure that you are on air on the uh, radio.co page so I will stop streams for the minute and go back to radio.co and you need to click on off air to bring your station on air. It says this will take up to 10 seconds to take effect. And now we can click on start streams. As you can see now we are streaming three seconds of audio. In this case, we are streaming in complete silence. So now we need to select some tracks to play on Play It Live. and you can hear the audio being played. Now if I mute my Play It Live, it 
So this is, uh, you currently can't hear this anymore, but if I play out the audio from radio.co, you'll be able to hear this song being played to radio.co. And it will be played with an ever so slight delay, as you would expect from an internet radio station. So now we're broadcasting to Radio.co. We're now up and running with Play It Live and Radio.co. If you want more videos like this one, please click the like button below and leave your comments in the comments section below. And to keep up with the latest goings on at Play It Software, you can subscribe to us on YouTube and like us on Facebook. I've been Jason Allen from Play It Software. <laughs>